Yeah. If we can get a, a face cap on this real quick. Mm -hmm. And that's the ribs for y'all. Got some good old steak there. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna add me up a little bit of a little bit of garlic in there. Go and get some salt up in there. Some of your Lowry's. Boy, always add some hot sauce. Okay, now I got some shrimp over here. I had a little bit of, a little bit of that in there. Okay. Don't really need to do too much. You know, not too much. You know. The steak, give it a little bit of special dressing. Okay. Get some black pepper. Let me show you some of the shrimp. And of course, this is your boy, the DN316. That little Dino, Philly's Family Jewels and Gems. And uh, just wanted to show you guys some of this food that's going on right here. You know. I'm going to be rolling that on out and putting it on a flat pan. I'm going to lay it up on a flat pan so you guys have my steaks here. So I'm going to make sure they definitely get all soaked up. Let that seasoning get all in there. in there and that's sitting real good right now then I'll get the shrimp mix that on up make sure it's nice and mixed up okay and that's good season I'm VID Owen so okay and there you have it Now this is for a dry bake. Set them straight on the pan. Ain't no butter, ain't no oil, ain't no nothing. This is just gonna cook just like that on this flat pan. Then I'm gonna get something and put the shrimp inside of there. So they can cook up also too. So that's the effects of how it is right here. 
Worldwide, worldwide, what's up, worldwide? It's your boy, the DN316. And this is a shrimp and steak V-I-D-E-O for you. Okay, what is up, worldwide? It's your boy, the DN316, and I'm back with another V-I-D-O for you, don't you know? And I'm gonna use, be using some Goya adobo on here. Give a nice sprinkle. These are pork chops, by the way. Pork chops. Okay. And here we got filet mignon. Filet mignon. Special seasoning. Can't talk about that one. Got you a little bit of garlic, you know what I'm saying? But if you notice, your boy is doing two things at once, so let me put a little bit in there too. Get all stuffed up in there. Some salt, child. Make sure you get your salt on up in there. Cool. If you want, you can use some accent. You know what I'm saying? You ain't gotta really be big on accent. Not too much. You know what I'm saying? You don't need too much accent. Accent is not a thing that's good for you. Accent really ain't good for you. You don't need too much accent. Okay, it's good, but you don't need too much. Until you get your black pepper. Get your black pepper there. Little black pepper. Okay. And that's pretty much all you need to do it up with. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so I mix one up. It's a dry bake almost. You know? Let's see that it's sitting there. Let's see if it's in there well. Okay, so what is up worldwide? It's your boy the DN316. And as y'all know, here it is the rice. And that's the rice for y'all. Just showing y'all the rice was done up nice. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's still worldwide, worldwide. What's up worldwide? It's your boy the DN316. And I'm back with my pig feet video, don't you know? And as y'all can see, the pig feet are falling off the bone. So that means it's actually really cooking up good. You see that? Falling off the bone. Grab another one. So y'all can see falling off the bone. See the bone right there? Go back. Let me show y'all so y'all can see it up in good close now. It's all falling off. Okay. 
Turn some tongs off for the next operation. Clean the screen. Something else to that pig feet so y'all can see what we Right now we're gonna let it sear up. We got the temperature down to a bit four. I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit lower to about a good three. I'm just gonna turn it a little bit lower, two and a half. Cover and let it go a little bit. But it's just about done. You know what I'm saying? We can see that bad boy is done. You know what I'm saying? Let's back up off the heat a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now we're gonna go on into here. So we can watch these ribs, these ribs is falling off the bone. And as you guys can see, simple slice, go through. Simple slice, go through. Okay? Simple slice, go through. Flip them around. See that right there? How that's falling off the bone. That's how you cook them ribs and bring them to that perfection. Now, worldwide. This is my pig feet with my macaroni and cheese. Now y'all see that right there. The boy's gonna destroy that later on. Okay, so thanks for, you know, let me show y'all how it goes and that's how it is worldwide. Thank you. As y'all can see, this the rib is probably coming off the bone. Um, your girl, the netty net is gonna try it. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, Baby. see if we can get a, a face cap on this real quick. Mm -hmm. And that's the ribs for y'all. You know what I'm saying? And then go to rice and everything else. Okay, so as always, thanks for letting me share my time with y'all on this holiday time. Do a little bit of cooking for y'all because your boy definitely went out there, seasoned it up, put in the oven, ran, did all the footwork. And I'm going to bring it to the people nice and good. Um, <laughs> Love you guys. This has been another, you know what I'm saying? V I E D E O. And what's the holiday, babe? Let them know. Labor Day. Okay, so that's Labor Day. And what's Labor Day memory of? Anybody know out here? Our veterans. Okay, so as you guys know, you got Labor Day, Memorial Day, all those different days, Christmas and everything. But this is a certain kind of day. So your boy banged out and cooked. You know what I'm saying? Because some people said they want some cooking videos. You know what I'm saying? This is going to be better cooking videos than that. But I just wanted y'all to see what we can do and we can hook up. Um, love you guys. Rate, comment, subscribe. As always, we'll be giving out some nice gifts when we get to 3,000 subscribers. Right now, we're a little shy under that. So we're trying to reach that number and get them 3Gs on there. And send some gifts out to some people who really deserve it. Who have been fans. Who have been loyal people who will fight with us. You know what I'm saying? So if y'all want to go out there and round up some groups of people and come on in and say let's subscribe to Philly's Funny Family, y'all do that. As always, rate, comment, subscribe, and you know, hit that post notification so we get that notification whenever we're L-I-V-E or when we post a new V-I-D-E-O. And here it is in effect. The girl, the netty net is tearing it up. And we are doing this L-I-V-E. And there she is, tearing it up. It's good. And she's going to edit this however she wants. What you got there, rice, greens, mixing it on a piece, 100 worldwide, times. Worldwide, what's up? It, <clears throat> what's up, my lovely jewels and gems? Philly's funny family. Uh, we will be back with an explanation on that one. We're going to go back to Philly's. Um, anyway, today we are starting with seasoning some boneless 
ribs, pork ribs. So Dean will be starting with first some apple cider vinegar. Where's the battery? We gotta get it done. Battery. Now we're gonna put a little bit of Special Italian seasoning. dressing. Yes, yes. This is how you marinate pork ribs. We have some onion powder. We have garlic powder. We have adobo. We have some goya. And then we're going to pour a little bit of hot sauce, crystal hot sauce, as a part of the marinade to help it tenderize. Mix it up well. Make sure every piece gets covered. And we will be putting this, we putting this at, we're going to add some holy sauce. That holy sauce drizzled. Drizzled. Good. And I'm guessing we're going to be putting this in the oven. Set to a baking rack. And we will be putting it in the oven and letting it cook up nice and tender. And we will be back.
Worldwide, worldwide, what's up worldwide? It's your boy the DN316. And we will be back. Hard to see with the heat. Take the zoom out of it. 